this is speedy path back today i have put the new stickers for my channel so that my fans can subscribe speedy path hope you guys like it now today i am going to tell few things which i have put on my duke 390 of course by uh, spyro see this is the one usb charger which i have put recently and this is a phone holder well it's not a very good one but yes for the time being i'm using it and i have some other plans for my uh, phone which i can fix it so that i can charge it through this usb so this usb has basically a charge switch off and on and one usb port of 5 volt yes so once you know i'll show you once again once i turn on the power then i have to turn on the switch then this red light hope you can see it's too sunny today this red light will be on this red light will be on once this red light is on you can connect your usb port and you can charge your uh, mobile phones or uh, any electronic gadgets which you are carrying like uh, gopro batteries and all yes you can do with the help of that uh, now next thing i would like to say last time when i was vlogging i said that there is one thing in duke 390 which is really very unique and it helps riders to understand how exactly they have to start the bike okay now first thing when the bike is on stand this exclamatory mark will come up now when it is in neutral yes obviously you can start the bike but when it is not in neutral you cannot start the bike Secondly, when the bike is on, this headlight will be on. So now you cannot see it in the daytime, but yes, once I go a little further, probably this headlight will this headlight will be on throughout the day during the traffic, during whenever you are going, this headlight will be on. So when the headlight is on people will come to know that you know they will be coming in front of you they will show you the and their hands but basically i feel it's very it's a very good feature because it's a it's a performance bike and when it comes to the performance bikes and bike and all you know people should see it from a longer distance because sometimes <laughs> there are riders in india who ride the bike very fast so what happens if people will not notice the the rider at the last moment will not be able to apply the brakes well yes abs is there but still i would feel that this headlight feature in duke 390 is much better so that you know people can recognize the bike coming in from a longer distance so that's all for today I know my bike is little dirty because I'm using it every day for my office walks and uh, I'm not getting time to clean it but yes very soon I'm going to clean the bike as well. Spyro will go for a washing. That's all. If you like this video please subscribe and stay tuned in my channel for my upcoming videos which will be very interesting. I have